What's up? I am back. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use the VBox or vertical box in JobIFX. So um, if you are working with VBox in your JobIFX application, uh, the VBox does the same for columns. So if the, um, if the horizontal box uh, arranges its children in a uh, row style then the VBox does the same for columns alright so I'm going to add the VBox at the center and I would like to add another buttons to see how it looks alright so the VBox does the same and if you would like to add space in between of them you will, you will still modify the margin something like this and also at the left side and at the top corner all right so that's how the vertical box works in JavaFX so in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make a simple application with horizontal box and vertical box uh, alright so here uh, at the FX layout.fxml I am going to add the border layout border pane layout and I'm going to add a H box inside the center alright you can add hbox and hbox directly at the layout or here so I have an hbox inside and I would like to add horizontal box I mean the vertical box V box alright so um, we has we have an hbox and V box here I would like to add label and and also another V box at the right side all right like this one um, <clears throat> let's resize the border pane and also the horizontal box I mean the vertical box something like this all right so I'm going to add a text field at the right side and let's rename the label as first name and the other one will be the last name Okay, and I'm going to resize the label, let's say 30 or 25, alright, as well as this one, let's make this 25 and resize the border pane again. Okay, I'm going to add margins in between of them. Let's say um, 20. Nope. 15. How about 15? Okay. And the margin at the right side, I mean the left side, let's say 10. or 20 how about 40 okay as well as the V box um, I'm going to add the top how about 30 no 10 
all right and I'm going to add another um, another edge box here inside the V box and I'm going to add buttons this will be save and cancel and change its margin fifteen and let's resize this all right So um, that's it. So I hope you learned something new in this tutorial. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, comment and share. And I will see you in the next video.